Are you procrastinating replacing your copier printer since it's time consuming and overwhelming? In this video, we're going to address the six things you need to consider when buying a copier or printer for your home or business use. I'm Trevor Russell and I'm a business consultant here at STPT. The first question you may be considering is, what copier is right for you? Some things you might want to consider are applications. Do you normally print on letter or legal, or sometimes do you have the need for 11 by 17 tabloid paper? Do you need finishing options, for example, stapling, hole punch, or maybe even booklet folding? Another thing to consider is where you'll be placing the copier. The location is very important, and you want to make sure that your location is size appropriate for your specific copier. The next thing and definitely the most important is volume. Understanding how much you're going to use the equipment helps us to properly size the machine that we recommend for your office or home. The last thing to consider is the number of people that will be using the copier. For example, if you have five to 10 users, we will want to ensure that you have the proper size piece of equipment so there isn't a line out the door as people wait to use the copier if it was sized too small. Another important factor is how much does the machine cost? I'm gonna break down the average cost of a small, medium, or large work group. The first thing we need to consider is if you're going to pay cash or lease the copier. Our most popular option is leasing as it's easy to budget and seems to be the way most consumers tend to buy a copier. Let's break down the cost on the three work group sizes. Small work groups, five individuals or less, volume might be around 1,200 copies per month. A color copier would be about $100, while a black and white may be closer to 80. For a medium work group, let's say 10 individuals or less with a volume of 5,000 copies per month. A color copier would be around 260, while black and white would be around 160. A large work group with 20 employees with volume around 10,000 impressions or copies per month, color copier would be around $500, and black and white around $300. These are base costs of machines. You're likely wanting to add additional features or storage, and regardless of whether you purchase or lease, you will want to include a maintenance plan. To help you understand your total cost of ownership, we have an article in our Learning Center that breaks down and provides more information. The next question is, who will service my product after it's been delivered? As a Xerox authorized partner, we have service technicians throughout all of North Central Texas. Our technicians are local, so they can respond to any service needs you might have very quickly. Additionally, an added benefit of working with us is that we have access to the entire Xerox service team. After you purchase your machine, you're gonna to want to know, how will I get my supplies? Most maintenance plans include auto toner replenishment. This means that we'll monitor your equipment, usage, and the toner levels and ship toner accordingly. If you purchase your copier without a maintenance plan, you'll need to manually call and reorder all supplies. When will my machine be delivered and do we provide training? Standard delivery is around one to two weeks depending on availability at the time of your order. Training is extremely important. We have a checklist that we follow of the most commonly used features of your product. That training typically happens upon delivery or shortly thereafter. Lastly, you'll need to know how to maximize the features of your product. And apps have invaded your copier just like your phone. There are so many apps available and more coming daily. You need to make sure you check out the Xerox Online App Gallery to ensure that you're not missing out on an important one that can improve your office productivity. After watching this video, you should have a better understanding of the six things to consider when buying a copier. If you want more information, click on the links below or head to our website to request a quote.